Thank you for joining us. And we're in the height of summer, but even a little fun season can bring a lot of stress. And did you know that there's help out there specifically for caregivers? Joining me today is Dr. Tamane Moss Torres from University Area CDC and therapist Sam Samantha Paris. <laughs> I said it correct 20 times before going on air, Samantha. And here we are. Welcome. <laughs> I'm so happy that you are here with us specifically to talk about stress. You know, we were saying that you know, it's summertime, the kids are out of school. Some parents just don't have the resources to even pay for camp or pay for anything, and they're at home. When does stress become unmanageable? Who can start? You know, we're finding that uh, parents who are coming to the University Area CDC already have other things happening, mm -hmm. including um, working um, post the pandemic, figuring right. out how to pay bills that were at one time just a normal way of life, and mm -hmm. so, this particular summer, stress has been um, compounded and we've been able to offer some supports for families at the mm -hmm. University of CDC through some classes for the summer for children at no cost to families. And also we've been able to acknowledge some of the concerns that parents have been speaking to us about through this stress management um, training session. And these trainings are particularly divided for men and women. Samantha, tell me about how Reach Up has been able to, you know, come up with this plan and help everybody that goes into the University Area CDC. Okay, sure. So when we initially started our stress management series, we started with um, moms and caretakers and kinship care, and we recently expanded to fathers as well. Mm -hmm. uh, because at Reach Up, we provide programming for both moms and dads also. Right. And so we recently added the dads because stress is, not gender specific. Mm -hmm. Stress is um, an equal opportunity. So everybody experiences stress. And then when we think about the family unit, we need everybody to be taken mm -hmm. care of. We need all of the caretakers to be taken care of. And so we've added the dads to that component too. And you asked the question about when does stress become mm -hmm. um, unmanageable? And we need to really be thinking about stress as a continuum. And so it's not like something happens today and it's over, but it compiles through time. And so that's what we hope to teach the, our families is how to manage it over a continuum of time and not just right, right now. And these workshops, you know, they're starting today specifically yes. for women. And how do people join and what can they expect with these workshops? I know you mentioned, you know, for the long term thing, but what else? Mm -hmm. So to um, join the groups, they can contact the University Area CDC as well as the Reach Up Office. And um, Dr. Charmaine can give more information on specific yeah. contact information. But as far as what to expect, they should expect um, to be informed and receive some educational information, but also a time to actually de-stress mm -hmm. and to be able to let out some of their stressors. They should be expect to go home with some practical tools that they can use on an ongoing basis, but really also a time just to, like I said, de-stress and mm -hmm. free their mind within that time period yeah. and take away some goodies. Dr. Chimane, what does it mean yeah. for the University Area CDC to have this type of availability for our, you know, our people are out there. They need this more than ever. You mentioned summertime is just hard this year. Yes, it is very difficult and it means the world to us because our goal is to support the community residents socially, economically, educationally. But this year in particular, the mental health component is very important. So we are um, investing our time and our energies to helping address these issues. And with these workshops, people are able to perhaps even talk to their family members, correct? It's yes. something that it's a family unit at this point when, it, when they go to these classes, correct? Mm -hmm. Yes, that's true. We're wanting to be able to provide resources, as Sam has said, yeah. and materials that they can use while they're at home. Mm -hmm. We also um, have opportunities for families to come into the center, to ask questions, use our center, to speak with persons about concerns in their lives, including other types of programs like health, wellness, um, affordable housing, anything that's going on in the family that's put them in a position wherein they're needing resources. At this particular time, one of our goals is to make sure whatever the families are needing, if we don't have it on, yep. on site, we will refer and make um, give supportive educational support for those families. In other words, the doors are always open at the University Area CDC and of course with Reach Up. Thank you so much, ladies, for joining us today. Thank you. All the information for signing up is on your screen. There's different sessions for men and women. The women start today and the 13th is the second session for men, July 20th and July 27th.